Hello, moms. This is Brianna. Hello, I'm sure you all know who I am. For those of you who are new to the group, I'm Brianna. I'm an empowerment coach for teen girls and young women. And I don't have a lot of time. I have a client session in about like 10 minutes. So I wanted just to come on really quickly and do a, a short Facebook Live about something that I that I see very often. And um, I see this a lot. <laughs> and I saw this in my own life before. I don't do this now, but before. And it's really about teaching your daughters to put themselves first, right? How do you do that? It really comes down to like leading by example. So I wanna ask you moms, are you putting yourself first at times? And I know some of you moms, you know, you may have more than one kid. You may have multiple kids. You may, you know, you have a lot going on. You might be working and then taking care of the family and just a lot of obligations, right? But it's so important to put yourself first at times because what, what I find that happens so much, um, you know, with the clients that I work with, with teen girls and young women, is that they don't know how to make themselves a priority in their lives. And so they put other things, um, you know, they make other things more important than themselves, such as friendships you know, friends suddenly become more important than, than doing things for themselves or, um, or a relationship, right? If, if your daughter doesn't know how to put herself first, then there is a high likelihood that she can get in a relationship one day and it's going to be all about the person that she's in a relationship with and making that person a priority and not knowing how to make herself a priority. And how does your daughter learn how to make herself a priority in her life? I mean, a lot of this comes down to, I think it comes down to self-care. And this is one of the things that I really encourage all of my clients to do for themselves. It's like, take time for yourself. What is it that makes you happy? What is it that you can do with yourself, by yourself, that really makes you feel good. Having self-care and not just doing it once in a while, like really making it a practice. It's something that is so important and most teen girls and young women are just not doing because they've learned somewhere along the way that it's more important to do, 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 be, 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 be busy, all the time, right? Instead of just taking a breath, slowing it down. You know, I'm gonna do, I think my next, I wanna do a Facebook Live on, um, on incorporating a spiritual practice and what that can look like for your daughter. Because I have a spiritual practice and gosh, it's, <laughs> It helps me so much in my life. I don't know what I would do without it. Um, I don't have time. I feel like that might be a little bit longer of a Facebook Live, and so I'll save that for next time. But I think that is really important. And so for, for the topic of this, you know, teaching your daughter to put herself first, I'm really talking to you moms. And are you putting yourself first? Are you making yourself a priority? Are you going and getting a pedicure or manicure once in a while for no other reason, not for a birthday, not because somebody gave you a gift card, but because you deserve it and it makes you feel good? What about getting a massage? When was the last time you got a massage for yourself? Oftentimes we get so busy, we get so wrapped up in our lives and I, I know a lot of you moms that are watching this are really, really busy, and I get it. But it's so important to take time outside of what you've got going with your career and your job, outside of what you've got going on with your family, 
and give that time for yourself. Whatever it is that makes you feel good, that makes you feel like you're prioritizing yourself. When you start doing that, and maybe some of you already are, and that's fantastic, but when you, if you're not doing this, then your daughter is going to learn to put others before herself and to put other, need, other people's needs and wants before her own. And it becomes a pattern. And I know I dealt with this in my life. I need to look at the time because I, okay, I have a few more minutes and then I have to run for my next client session. I know I did this in my life. I would put everyone's needs before my own. It never served me. Might have served my friends or the relationships that I was in. I even did this, you know, within my own family. Put other people's needs before my own. Also because I was always concerned about, you know, um, not hurting, hurting anyone else's feelings. Right? But I, I wasn't paying attention to my own feelings. So this is a really important thing for your daughter, but it's a really important it's really important for yourself as well. So moms, start making yourself a priority. Do the things that you want to do for no other reason than you're worth it and you deserve it. Because when you start showing up for yourself in a different way, you are teaching your daughter how to do the same thing for herself. And her life will be better because She's learned this from you. So take some time out this week. Go get a manicure. Go get a pedicure. Go get that massage. Go take that dance class that you really want to take. Go um, buy yourself some flowers because you really want them and you deserve them. I picked up some flowers for myself today. Why? Because I love flowers and they make me feel good. And I'm prioritizing myself and that's really important. So take some time out this week, prioritize yourself, and your daughter will learn from you. Mwah. Sending you all so much love. Take care. Bye.